A few months ago, I started a new project after discovering a game called Territorial.io and wanted to mix it with one of my favorite games, Europa Universalis 4. Both are conquest games, but one is more abstract and the other one more based on actual world history. I basically wanted to generate my own worlds and see countries evolve in it. But how can this be achieved easily? First, I made a program to generate continents. It was very interesting, I started with a basic Perlin noise and improved it by casting it on an irregular grid. This, with some extra steps, led to the first continents. It was now time to generate countries and make them fight. The rest of the code is more complex. We first generate provinces, which are just a way to represent some territory. Each province need to know its neighbors. Then, we make some provinces become countries and other ones wilderness, and let the simulation begin. Countries attack each other, capturing one province at a time. Their goal is to conquer as much territory as possible. Some of the factors impacting the military power of a country is the presence of a coast and its superficy. In the end screen, we can see the borders of each province, the capital provinces of every country and their capital city, the White Cross. Rebels can spawn if a country is losing wars too often or if the country is too big, depending on some parameters. If a very strong country win a war against a comparatively very weak country, it can absorb all of its provinces. Provinces of a country that aren't connected to their capital either become independent or part of another country. We can also use existing images as starting point for the generation, let's look at some of them.
I hope you enjoyed this video, it was really fun to do and I will probably continue working on my own on this project. Let me know if you want to be kept updated on it.